Hi Cancer, welcome to my channel. Okay, I'm doing a reading for you, dealing with all signs. This is a singles read. Do not force it to fit if it is not your story. It cannot and will not resonate with each and every one of you. And I'm just going to get straight into it because it's a quick reading. So, <clears throat> Cancer dealing with an Aries. Cancer dealing with an Aries. The Aries wants a commitment. They want um, a stable life with you. Oh yeah, they're trying to find the strength and the courage right now. What else for Cancer dealing with an Aries? Anything else? Oh, <laughs> bless them. Okay, they're not sleeping very well at night. They're so anxious. They could be a little bit depressed right now. What is the line of swords? Over the distance between you two. There's so much distance between you. And it's, they're not doing very well on this. Pretty sure. Why, why does the Aries need strength and courage? <coughs> <coughs> the Aries is trying to find the strength and the courage to take this leap of faith towards you. They want marriage with you. They want a commitment with you. Alright? But they're extremely worried. They're probably worried about what you're going to say, how you're going to react. But they are... They're, they're fearing the distance between you two. It could be physical distance, but there's like there's planning. They're worrying about planning to come towards you or anything like that. But anyway, okay. Cancer dealing with a Taurus. If you're dealing with a Taurus, they're sad. They're possibly sad over you because a third party was involved, or they're sad because they used their intuition and they wanted to celebrate. But I'm feeling they're, they're sad over a third party. Queen of Cups, I'm feeling that that's you, Cancer, okay? Queen of Cups, you're my, intu my intuitives, my psychic mediums. So they could be sad. You could have found out about a third party. They could be sad because you found out about a third party. So that's you and the Taurus. Alright. Cancer dealing with a Gemini. The Gemini could be juggling, okay, we've got the juggling out here, two of pentacles, trying to make a decision, queen of pentacles and the nine of cups, that is wish fulfillment, but what are they juggling, what is Gemini juggling, fuck me, cancer, lying, cheating, stealing, sneaky, deceptive behaviour, they're juggling whether or not to do this to you. What is the Seven of Swords? What's the Seven of Swords? There is someone else, third party. Celebration, fuck. They could be dealing with this Queen of Pentacles, this Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, doesn't have to be. What the hell is their wish fulfillment? What is Gemini's wish fulfillment? To leave you out in the cold. Or maybe they see your wish fulfillment to leave them out in the cold. You can you can reverse these energies. Okay. If, if we do this the other way, they could feel like you're juggling them, you're being sneaky and deceptive towards them because of a third party who is your Queen of Pentacles. Just take what resonates there, guys, okay? Right, if you're dealing with Leo. Do that again. Cancer dealing with a Leo. Cancer dealing with a Leo. Right, if you're dealing with a Leo, they're sick and tired of the competition, the fights. They want the competition and the fights and the jealousy and the gossip all to stop, but they are still holding back from you. If you're dealing with a Virgo. Nice. Okay, the Virgo is going to end a situation so they can come give you an, a tangible offer. So it has to end for this new beginning to start, but they would like a new beginning with you and offer you stability. Okay, if you're dealing with a Libra, Cancer dealing with a Libra. Again, they're either wanting a celebration or this is a third party situation. The King of Pentacles is out here. They could want you to be their spouse or your origin. Well, no, it's a, this is a singles read. Or they could already have a spouse. They're kind of hanging themselves right now. They're not making any movements. They're, they feel stuck and stagnant. But some truth 
They want to tell you about some sort of truth. So shall we be nosy and find out? What is the Three of Cups for Cancer dealing with a Libra? What is the Three of Cups? They're not single. If they told you they're single, they are not. They are not single and abundant. What is this King of Pentacles? They're sad and regretful over a King of Pentacles. What is the Ace of Swords? What is this truth coming out? What's the Ace of Swords? Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. The truth coming out from this Libra. They either see you as a missed opportunity, they're bored, or you have rejected them and they feel sad, or somebody else has rejected them. In and out energy. They probably promised you the world, but then they didn't. They were in and out, they're a player. Yeah, Queen of Swords. It doesn't look like they've got anything to offer you, apart from a cold heart. The Queen of Swords, basically, if someone comes near them, they'll chop them head off if, if they don't come with the truth and loyalty. They're hiding secrets from you. Something is their wish fulfillment. They feel left out in the cold, or they're going to leave you out in the cold, and they just want to move forward. It's supposed to be quick readings anyway. What are they hiding? Clarify the moon. What are they hiding? They're hiding the fact that they're no longer spying on you, or they could be spying, stalking and hacking. Trying to see what you're up to. What is this wish fulfillment from Libra? What is the wish fulfillment from Libra for Cancer? Their wish fulfillment, they want truth. Okay, they want truth, they want loyalty, they want honesty. Oh, could be because of a betrayal and a, and a deception because of this. But I don't know, you know your story. Right, Scorp yeah, I'm Scorpio now. Cancer dealing with a Scorpio. I nearly did that the other way around. I nearly said Scorpio dealing with a Cancer. Yeah, oh, nice. Okay, Scorpio. They could either be dealing with somebody from their past that they've had a new beginning with, a very new passionate beginning with, or um, the Scorpio is somebody from your past. They want to offer you a tangible new beginning, and my God, do they want to get you in the sack. Take what resonates there. Alright, Cancer dealing with a Sagittarius. Cancer dealing with a Sagittarius. <clears throat> the Sagittarius feels a bit stuck and bound. They're overthinking the situation. They're trying to manifest an ending for a new beginning. They could be dealing with a Scorpio or an Aries, a Gemini, Libra. Sorry, no, yeah. Could be a Gemini, could be a Libra, could be... Um, Virgo as well, in that. I think there was no there. Anyway, that's like fair. Right. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, dealing with a Capricorn, you two could be fighting over a third party situation over another woman, over somebody else. Competition, there's fighting, there's jealousy, there's gossip over a Queen of Wands, over somebody else. Could be an Aries Leo or a Sag. Oh. Alright, if you're dealing with. An Aquarius. Cancer dealing with Aquarius. They're moving forward, but they're still going to spy on you. They still want to try and get information on you. Now, if you're dealing with a Pisces, expect communication from them. Oh, actually, no. Expect communication from their other half. I'm sorry, but I heard that. Expect communication from this Pisces' other half. The person that they're with. Why? Why is Cancer going to get communication from Pisces' spouse? Did you two collaborate? Did you two have a fling? Something's going on there. Yeah, but Mother Day. Oh, fuck me. Cancer, what did you get yourself into? Clarify the Eight of Wands. I'm not taking all of that. Clarify the Eight of Wands. Oh, my God. Okay. This person's spouse really wants to talk to you. Bottom of the deck, the Seven of Swords. Fuck. I, I don't particularly want to get into this energy, but Cancer, uh, be aware that a Pisces spouse really wants to talk to you. <laughs> and the world card that was flipped over in the deck, the one that was the wrong way around, is your own card, Chariot. Run. 
Cancer, if you were dealing with the Pisces and they already had a spouse, run. Okay, that's all I can say. Right, okay, Cancer, I'm done.